All right, so now let's go ahead and look at letter B. So in this case, they want to find which, which of these angles is going to produce 1. So remember, these points on the unit circle, and remember, our constraint constrains us only to the first quadrant. So um, if we want to find B, remember, tangent is y over x. So what I can do is I can simply just take all of these coordinate points and just do y over x and see which one of those is going to give me 1. So what if I did tan of pi over 6? Tan of pi over 6 is 1 half over square root of 3 over 2. Does that equal 1? No. So that's not going to work. What about tan of pi over 4? That equals square root of 2 over 2 divided by square root of 2 over 2. Will that give me 1? Yes. And since that's the only angle that is in the first quadrant that when I do a ratio of the y over x, I get 1, that's going to be my angle. So therefore, pi over 4 is my angle in radians. So I could say theta equals pi over 4 or 45 degrees. So it's the exact same thing.